y'all hey welcome to a new vlog um i'm janelle if you are new i be forgetting to say that i mean even though my channel is janelle's life but just in case i'm janelle if you are new okay so today um i just now left out the house i'm actually in the garage so i'm about to go to the seafood market i call it the seafood market but it's actually the asian market because i want to cook today and um i want some seafood yeah so i was like you know okay let me just start up a new vlog because i'm a cook in this vlog so um i'm not really sure yet what i want to cook but i'm gonna see what goodies they have when i get there and i'll try to vlog a little bit when i get there because um i'm looking for a few things a few other things and you know when you don't really shop in a market all the time you don't know where everything is i don't really know if i'm a vlog that much in there but anyway so yeah i just wanted to introduce the vlog and I'm on my way. Look at this. <laughs> Super slim, okay? Super slim. It's just not happy weather. Like, this is just a mess. But um, I'm going to show y'all all my goodies I got. Oh, my goodness, y'all. Can y'all please drive carefully? I'm going to show y'all all my goodies that I got when I get in the house. Because these people, these people. Okay, y'all. So, I just made it back in the house. I just now um, slipped on, like, some little biker shorts because my sweatpants was wet. So, once again, it's a little grocery haul. So, I decided that I'm going to make... um. Linguini pasta with a fried crab on top. That's what I'm gonna make. So I'm gonna show y'all what I bought from H Mart, and um, we gonna go from there. So I'm gonna try these little um, pot stickers. They the vegetable ones. I've never bought these before, so I'm gonna try these. Not today though. But um, for that, that lady gave me so many bags. I bought some garlic. Yeah, um, garlic. Actually, I think, like, um, this type of garlic, to me, is a little bit more potent than fresh garlic. I, I like to taste garlic. So, y'all already know I had to get some potatoes. That's a given. Ain't going nowhere without them. Um, that lady gave me so many bags. So, I got some shrimp. I'm going to try these noodles. So, these noodles, they didn't say anything about, like, beef or chicken or pork. So, and it don't say vegetable either. It just say fried noodles. So, I'm thinking that they just regular, smegular, original noodles. No type of, you know, meat flavor. So. And I had to get some more fish seasoning. Um, That was one of the reasons why I wanted to go there, too. Um. Of course, you can get this from, like, other markets. But, yeah, I needed this. I needed this. And this was the Lando Lakes I got because, like I said, the other one was $8.99. I was not trying to pay $8.99. Like I said, I don't always look at prices, but I don't really remember Lando Lakes being $8.99. But y'all tell me. I don't know because every city, state is different. And let's see what else. Okay, so I bought this common tea. Which, to me, it gets no calmer than me. Unless somebody is trying to annoy me or antagonize me. But anyway, yeah. <laughs> this. Because I stay to myself. Linguini noodles. I had to get some vegetable oil to fry the crab. I got self... I bought the wrong thing. This is self-rising cornmeal. I need a self-rising flour. I'm just have to use the flour I have, which is um, all-purpose flour. Hopefully, that don't make it taste no different. But so I had to get buttermilk because that's what I'm gonna use to fry the crab. 
and I got some juice. I really wanted some green tea. I did not see it. I know they had it in there, but I did not see it. So, also, in this bag, we got three live crabs. I only brought three. I'm going to fry all three of them. So, first, whoo, they stink. First, we're going to steam them first. So, let me put all this stuff up, and then I'll be right back. All right, y'all. So, I don't even know if I had mentioned today is Sunday. Today is Sunday. So, anyway, um, I have my water boiling because, of course, the crabs are live. I have to steam them first. Then I'm going to fry them. And then that's when, um, after they... After I steam them is when I'm going to put my linguine pasta on. So, I'm going to get out another pot so I can have that ready. But, y'all, I have been drinking water for the last two days straight. I did not have nothing else in here to drink. When I tell you, I was at my wits end. Because, like, yesterday I was being super lazy. I did not really feel like leaving out. I wanted to leave out, but I didn't really feel like leaving out. You know how that go. So, um, I was just like, oh, my goodness. I need me some green tea. I need me some iced tea. I'm so thirsty by the way water does not quench my thirst by no means so um and then goes to the market and only get one thing to drink because i couldn't find green tea like that is crazy and this will be gone by tomorrow because oh my goodness i'm so thirsty I didn't have no more crystal light in here. I cannot wait. I'm just going to go ahead and get me a Costco membership. I'm not going to be buying a whole bunch of stuff in bulk. But damn it, I'm going to buy iced tea in bulk. That's for sure. Um. So also, I'm not going to like season the crabs a whole lot. Because when I fry them, I'm going to season them also. So, where is my... Let me see. So what I think I'm going to do, I think I might just put some Obey in the pot. Yeah, I think I'm going to do that because it's no reason to like overly season them when I'm going to season them again. Like I said, when I fry them. So it's no point. So yeah, I'm going to wait until this get nice and boily. And then, um, and by the way, all of my, um, the little bit of groceries that I bought, I think that they came to, um, let me see. $68. I always like to tell y'all because, you know, everything is just so over the top now with prices. So I just be wanting to let y'all know, like, what you might get in Maryland for this or that. But, yeah, $68. So, I don't know. Like, the crabs was 7 Let me see. The crabs were seven dollars and ninety one cent, and the shrimp were. Where's the shrimp at on here? It's crazy because this garlic costs the same amount as the crabs, but I'll have this for a while. Um, where is the shrimp at on here? Um, let's see, let's see, let's see. I do not even see it. Oh my goodness. I don't even see it. I don't even. Did she even ring them up? I don't know. I don't see them. Unless they calling them something else. I don't know. But, um, yeah, so. I'm going to wait until this bull and then I'll be right back. So, so y'all, I was just FaceTiming my mother. And, by the way, my mother gave me this idea to fry crabs because I haven't had a fried crab in eons. Anyway, I was FaceTiming her and talking to her, and then I heard this noise, and I was like, I forgot that the crabs was in the bag. <laughs> I forgot they was in the bag. So the water is boiling. Let me see. The water is boiling. I'm just going to put... some Obey in there. Is this the top? No, that's not the top. That's the top to that. All right, so this is the top. All right, so here we go. Where is my... Oh, here we go. Woo! They be fighting! 
y'all. Come on. They be fighting. <laughs> ah! He was holding on. I hate to do that, you know, because, I mean, y'all know I love seafood. Y'all know I'm a pescatarian, but this part still makes me sad. It really does. Before it's all said and done, well, I I don't even want to speak to you soon, but my chest hurt. That shit, I thought he was going to bite me. <laughs> I'll be back, y'all. <clears throat> so, y'all, I just now put my water on for my linguine pasta, and then now I'm about to um, take the shell off these shrimp so I can saute shrimp and... The meal is basically going to be halfway, halfway complete. But yeah, let's see. So this, um, oh yeah, I wanted to tell y'all. So I don't know who all be on TikTok. I'm thinking everybody. But anyway, it was this guy on TikTok who had made this video talking about um, do not buy Crocs. And he like took his Croc off of his foot. I thought he was about to say something bad about Crocs. Because y'all know that's basically all I wear. It's like every time I go in my closet to get other shoes, I come out with Crocs on. Like I don't understand what's happening. Like literally, I don't understand what's happening. That is all I wear every single day. And I really need to stop. But anyway, he was like, do not wear Crocs. And then it was, and I was listening like, what is he about to say? And he was just like, you're going to find yourself wearing them every single day like me. He said, you're going to find yourself wearing them to places that you shouldn't even be wearing them. He said, they are so addictive because of the comfortability. He was like, I'm just telling y'all, if you don't want to run down this whole like rabbit hole like me, just do not buy Crocs. But of course he said it with way more enthusiasm than me. But that shit was so funny because I'm sitting here thinking like, what is he about to say? But um, it looks like my crabs are... See, they're done. You just keep them on, just on low, just for a minute.
buttermilk. Pour this in here. So now I have to, um, cause the pan that I was using for my pasta is the pan I'm going to, well, the pot I'm going to use to fry the crab. So, um, let me get that together because I almost forgot about that. probably thicker than this so if y'all want to make this make sure you um pay attention and get that because i saw self rising it was out the day going door and it was cornmeal so yeah just packing it on just packing it on like this All right, y'all, so everything is done, and this is the taste test, but of course I know how to make, you know, pasta and shrimp, but I have um, never fried a crab before, so. That garlic isn't as potent that I thought. It's not, mm-hmm. So, this the um, fried crab. This one, the leg had already came off before I even fried it. Break it open. Um, I knew it was something I'm missing. Butter. Let me put butter over top. Okay. The batter is not bad. Not at all. I would just say, if y'all make this, add more seasoning. Because I'd be trying not to overdo it because I'm very heavy-handed when it comes to seasoning. And I don't be wanting to have my salt intake so high. But, um, I like it. Yeah, I like it. So, let me finish eating. And then I'll be back. Now, wait a minute. For all of the people that drink, of course, you know when you steam crabs, it is more potent when you steam them in beer. I do not drink. So, anyway, so if you steam them in beer and I believe fry them, it'll give them just a little bit more flavor. But, yeah, I'll be back. So, y'all, everything is clean. I just now clean everything up and um, put the stuff I don't feel like cleaning in the dishwasher. And I'll cut that on tonight. But for now, I'm using... What is this? I'm using my Tiger Balm 
on my knee because I swear to you, if y'all saw that video when I showed y'all the skates that I bought, it was the day that I ordered the skates, not the day that I showed y'all the skates because they took like 10 days to come. It was the day that I ordered those skates, which I got to look back and see what day that was, was the day my knee started hurting, like literally. I have never had a problem with no aches and pains and, you know, none of that stuff besides like stomach aches back in the day. But yeah, like so far as, you know, joint pain and you know how people just be having aches and pains. Like I have never had that problem until that day I said, you know what, I'm going to get me some skates. Order those skates like later on that day my knees start hurting. I'm like, what the hell is going on? And now my knee be hurting like sporadically. So when I go to my doctor's appointment next month, I'm gonna let him know. I don't know what all tests they take to try to figure out what it is. It doesn't ache every day, all day, but yeah, my knee, my right knee has been bothering me sporadically. And I'm just like, what in the hell is going on? So that's that, but besides that, and I be using like a little Q-tip because um this stuff is so strong. You do not want to get this stuff on your hands or nothing. I, the smell of it will take your ass out for real. It depends on if that like um menthol smell bothers you. This would not be something you would want to buy. This is very strong, it, but it works though. It really do work. The only difference between this and Icy Hot to me is Icy Hot, you kind of feel it, which I do like Icy Hot too. You kind of feel it. Well, you know what? When I was saying I ain't had aches and pains, remember I told y'all I have a, like a little small bunion on my right foot. So yeah, that happened. That started um, developing in 2016. So yeah, so scratch that. Yeah, I have, but not my knee. But anyway, that doesn't bother me um, at all. And I think because I wear Crocs all the time. But like if I was wearing like heels and stuff like I used to, that would not work. It would not work. And it really, my podiatrist said that it developed from years of wearing high heels because typically high heels was um, a part of my everyday attire. You know how like y'all might see certain people wear heels like, and you would be thinking like, where the hell are they going? I was one of those people. I wasn't going anywhere and I would be wearing heels every single day. Oh my goodness. Energy is so loud. Yeah, I would be wearing heels every single day, going to the market, going nowhere. And that's what he told me. But I really feel like my career, my past career, having to wear like combat style boots for 20 years, I believe that's what happened. But like I said, it developed in 2016 out of all the time that I had to wear boots. So I really don't know which one to believe, honestly. But yeah, besides that, y'all, my knee is really hurting. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to relax. Um, it's only 3.47. I'm gonna relax. And, yeah, I'm gonna take a shower like around 8 o'clock. It's a lot happened since the last video. Now, keep in mind, it's a video that drops today. And it drops at 4 o'clock, actually. So, when y'all hear that video, y'all see, y'all really know a little bit about what I'm talking about. I'll talk more about it soon but it's a lot that happened within like 24 24 hours yeah not bit not nothing bad but just like stuff just it, life is crazy i'm telling you life is crazy i might have a story time coming soon i'm just trying to um think about how i want to present the story time because it's a lot that i be wanting to say but then i never want to say too much if if you get what i'm saying so anyway um I'll figure that out later. But for right now, I'm about to drink this juice. Oh, my goodness. Like, I told y'all, this juice is going to be gone before tomorrow, probably. And then I'm going to be back to fucking drinking water because I only bought one thing of juice like a damn fool. So, no, what I'm going to do is be back in the store. But um, looking for some green tea. But anyway, this was a very short vlog. A very short mini vlog, should I say, because... Yeah, <laughs> so anyway, thank you so much for watching, y'all. Do not forget to subscribe. Leave a comment if y'all have ever fried crabs. Leave a comment, and if y'all have another recipe for it, leave a comment. And I know my girl, Farmer, that's her last name because we used to go by last name. I know she probably watching this, girl, and she could cook her ass off, by the way. If you ever fry crabs, leave your recipe down below because maybe it's another way that I can do it. Like I said, I had bought the wrong... um.
well, I didn't even buy flour. I bought cornmeal. But anyway, yeah, let me know. Because I'm really thinking that I should have used um the Louisiana fish fry, but not the fish fry. I like the shrimp fry. Because I just like flavors, y'all. I like to taste like every teeny piece of my food. It was good. Don't get me wrong. But I wanted the batter to be so much more. But anyway, thank you so much for watching. Do not forget to leave a comment. Do not forget to subscribe and share the video. Also, turn on your post notifications because my schedule been crazy. It's been crazy dropping these videos. But thank you again. Have a nice day, y'all. See y'all in a few days.